Through the stormy weather, I have wrapped myself in you. But on these icy highways, I am spinning out of truth. Country music is sewn into the fabric of this place. You know, I, I love country music and I always will, but I wish it was the kinder, more open place. I identify as a two-spirit person. I also identify as a gay man. That's all so important for me to say just up front because it's my identity. And for so long, I feel like lots of people in minority groups have had to kind of minimize their identity. Conservative small place in the middle of Saskatchewan. Little boys got more to hide than anyone. I wrote that song in about 15 minutes and I felt such sympathy for 14 year old me having all these confusing feelings and not really knowing what was right and what was wrong and I just wanted to give that person a hug. So my way of doing that was by writing the song of being like, you know, you have to know, you have to know. But there's a home on a rainbow. I came to do what I wanted to do, what I originally set out to do and um, that's write a really good queer themed country song that was unapologetically gay. Let's say that. Six sounds fun until it's done. The kind of things I write about made a lot of audiences uncomfortable. When this indigenous kid who happens to be queer is starting to write songs about falling in love with a guy, the audiences just didn't want to hear it at the time. And a lot of the other country artists didn't want to share a bill with me. It just became very, very hard to work. And sure enough, you know, we found our audiences and we found some safe spaces, but it was such a battle. Me and my family didn't talk about it a whole lot. I didn't want to make them uncomfortable. When I eventually did come out to them, it was mostly uh, just love and acceptance. Some fear because they, uh, they know stories about how people are treated around around these parts, I guess I could say. Prince Albert is absolutely beautiful. It is a unique place. I'm so used to it because I grew up here. Um, I wrote a line once upon a time saying that the city streets are like the back of my hand. It's home. I don't know what, what else to say other than it's home. Um, but people can have complicated relationships with their homes. I stick around PA, I still like it. I want to make things uh, better for uh, people like myself while living here, being a part of uh, the indigenous community and the queer community. Oh, I'm still human. I have been primarily working in country music for the past five years. That's all changing right now. We're, we're moving into uh, the pop world and making that kind of music now. Uh, but I hope we left a, a little bit of a mark in, in the country music scene so that the next person that comes and that tries to be, you know, a, a country music artist in Saskatchewan that also happens to be writing about, you know, uh, their identity. I hope they have an easier time than I did.